top of bodies. They said there was claw marks on those wooden floors as people were trying to crawl their way out as they were screaming and burning to their death. I think one of the most convicting things about that whole story was what a witness said. They said the reason that so many died, the reason that so many perished, there was a bouncer there. His job was to protect. His job was in case of a disaster, point the way of escape. You know what that bouncer did? He went out the fire door himself. He saved himself and didn't sound the alarm how to get out. And they listened to me, Christian, and listened to me careful. They said there were so many par people perished because there was no audible voice on how to get out. Is this the same guy from the last video? Bouncer knew the fire escape. He let the masses pile up and burn. Christian, you know the fire escape? You know how someone can be delivered from a burning it, hell? It must be. Are you living your life like the bouncer? Yeah. Great, right, I've taken the fire escape. And there the masses, by the millions, are piling up, clawing their way, lifting their eyes in a burning hell as the church remains silent. The lead singer from that band, band his name is Jack Russell. He said this. He said, I was in a daze and a stupor, almost unresponsive for three months. He said, I cried every night. All right, poor. this is this is wonderful kind of stuff, this? but honest to goodness, said, this I'll is no. I can't get over it. This is uh, this is not Nor really the. Uh, you know what our problem, Christian is. It's okay. That's all. What I can't believe that's twice in a row. Now it is a Sunday morning. Okay, that's wonderful and look yeah that's that's just great and all that and but not the purpose of my videos no it's not why are we still getting these what this is a complete flashback Come on. okay resume game casual match same things Maybe I should take payload rays off I mean we keep this is just giving you a payload map something what are the odds that I would end up in you know a map with the same guy that's just uncanny he sounded like Jimmy Stewart there it's like Jimmy Stewart preaching the, the gospel here is the That's a thing, I guess? Is that a meme? I, You know, let's, let's talk about that for a minute. I don't think that is the right way to convert people to Christianity. That's not, you know, it's not a matter of, well, you know, follow Jesus because otherwise you're going to hell. That's not the approach. That's not, not like God's just threatening you because you want some more followers on Instagram. That's not how this works. You need, you know... You need Christ in your life to get you through your life and to give you strength for your life and to carry you through things. And then, at the end, yes, you're, there is, you know, you get to go to heaven. But, I mean, that's not just, it's not just about going to heaven. Let's just dance a little bit. There's more to it than that. God is not, you know, looking to whoop you if you don't show up on his, his Facebook page. He's, he wants you to have a full life. And so many people, they resist, you know, a life of faith because they go, oh, I, I'm not going to follow a God who just wants to throw me into an oven. I mean, that makes perfect sense. And, but you have to realize, you don't put your, you know, God doesn't send you to hell. You put yourself in hell because you reject his presence. You don't want to be with him for eternity. Why? Well, because a life where you've, you've done nothing but live for yourself, it's, it's kind of hard to then, you know, stand before God and say, hey, you know. Basically, it's like this. Heaven is a gift, all right? It's a gift that 
Christ gives you by dying on the cross. But, can you accept the gift? That's what it comes down to. And it's, it's, it's a hard thing to do. It is difficult. So that's why you want to develop a relationship with them. I mean, you know. It's not a matter of, you know, let's, you know, you are going to hell if you don't. All right, you know. And I'm not saying there's no hell, but I'm saying that I think that's the wrong way to, to convince people of, of, of why they should be followers. You know what I'm saying? I don't know that it's, it's effective. That's why I'm not just recording him and carrying him along here, you know? And I think... Okay, that was really weird. The, my, my fraps cut out while I was having that discussion on things religious completely. I should get, I should get a... Uh... Oh, we're already fighting? I thought we were still setting up. It cut out and I missed the entire round. We won that round. I, I got to be MVP and none of it was recorded. I... Okay, let's, let's do what we were going to do. Um, entrance. So that's just weird. Why the heck? I mean, grant you, every so often it just does that anyway. I don't, especially with TF2. For some reason, with TF2, periodically, I don't know if it sends a command to do certain things. It's the same command as turning off your your fraps. Prepare to compete in We're gonna mostly worry about getting. Okay, I think he's dead. Oh, is this like the warm-up round and it's not really when we're, we're even doing anything? Oh, yeah, that's good. But that's just weird. The weird that I had this whole conversation after that got cut off. So strange. Okay. I'm going to try and be the engineer my team deserves here. We've got a couple. That's a good thing. Okay, we got 47 seconds to hustle ourselves up here. We want someplace somewhat protected. Okay, this is good. Give them the back to the wall. Give them a gun to keep them safe. We literally to protect this position. Actually, you know what? What we might be good here. Right here. I don't know that they could get a. Uh, Okay, this is a pretty good nest. Let me get this upgraded. That was a long pause to get that going. Level three, good. We do need this gun. Burned down, but it's still alive. Now. Yeah, but my point was, you know, I mean, you know, Christ wants a relationship with you, not just to... The car, don't just shoot at it. Not just to be the, the boogeyman. That's not, you know, I know so many people who look at him like he's a boogeyman. Oh, so much for my base. He's not the boogeyman. literally died on a cross to take the weight of the, the sins of the entire world because he didn't want to be without you. This isn't working out. We're getting rolled. I am not oh, the engi fun. currently the engineer yeah, that my uh, team needs me to be. I don't know. I think we might need this to go 
to something different here. We have two engineers. Oh, there, yeah, they're, they're almost there. We have no time to set up. Well, if you could be the pyro, my team needs me to be. Oh, where's that coming from? Okay. Nice beard. It's a good beard. And again, I'm not saying that there's not a heaven and a hell, but I'm saying if you approach it from that point, you're going to have a relationship with God that's based on resentment, and that's not what, that's not what works. Hello! Which is an odd thing for me to, to do as I'm set. Why won't this guy, oh, he must have a, uh, a charge and charge, I'll bet. Had the fire resistance. All right, so we there is the engineer we our team needs us to be. Okay, so we we did some good things there finally. That's why you know. I did stay with that round with the guy doing the fire and brimstone preaching because I don't know. I can help. Come on. There we are. All right. Well, at least... At least save the teleporter. Let's see if we can be the pie bro that this engineer needs. Where the heck did he get shot from? How the heck is there a dot there? How? I'm a spy. Guys, I'm a spy. I'm standing on top of this thing. That's good to know. Alright, we did some good things there. It was a sacrificial kind of thing. Beep boop. He's my nemesis at this point. And we're gonna lose. I do well enough. See, my, my points are pretty good. But that might include the last round there, but... Yeah, you can only do what you can do. Alright, you're not a spy. Should I go be try to be the engineer my team needs now? You only have one. Mission begins in 30 seconds. Alright, let's let's do that. Let's try to go. I am an engine main for heaven's sake. Heaven is a Murgatroyd. Throw that down. Teleporter going up. I'm turning into a pyro main. For a sheer lack of skill, but mission begins in ten seconds. Ten whole seconds. All right, Five, we might have to just four, pick a midpoint to set up one. in here. Let's put the gun down. I think this is good. Where's some metal? Yeah, we'll crank up a... Uh... If we get this to level 2, that would be beneficial. Okay. A level 2 going there. Next we'll throw down... The teleporter exit. And, if we can, oh man, they're coming. That's not exactly the most optimal place, because it can be spawn camp, but we're, we're, we're under time pressure here to get something going. I need a dispenser here. There's metal. Let's grab it. Metal, I got your metal. Woohoo! Now let's do some upgrades. Oh, 
Oh, that was poor timing. Great timing by the spy. Where the heck's the rest of my team? It's the standard thing to say whenever you get killed. Remember that. Whenever you get killed, say, Where the heck's the rest of my team? You're fighting the entire enemy team alone. <sighs> okay. Let's just run up here. Focus on getting a gun up. Oh, this is, yeah, we'll have to go up here. Up and around, up and around, up and around, up and around. Okay. Sentry gun. What's the best angle to have here? Oh, if we can get it up, this will work, but it's, it's, it's going to be vulnerable. Where is the metal? There's, there's a, a good source of metal. Radic, radic. We got uber oomph going, so we may as well... May as well stop. I fell down. Well, this spy is on my case. I missed... Man, spies? That spy? Okay, wrench this sucker. It's not going. Let us be honest. This is not going well. Fall back. Oh, man, I am getting annihilated by this spy. Now there's not enough time to set things up. Unless the rest of my team can do something. We've got a couple engineers. If we would just focus on one one nest. Just touch it. There you go. I'm waiting for you. Probably a ringer too. Oh man, two spies. And again, I'm up here alone with two spies. If I had a pyro, a pie bro. Alright, fine. You wanna be that way? They got two spies, I got a pyro. Obviously, if someone needs to be the pie bro that our team needs, so this NG can do something. Fine, guys, I'll go pie bro. There's too many spies to set up. Not that that helped at all. I'm dead again. They're like all over the place. All right, Angie, if you set up where I'm standing, I'll try and keep the spies off you. <laughs> yeah, everybody's a fire guy. And if you don't set up there, then I'm not going to do anything. So I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Remember, we don't have to push him back. Uh, you want to set up here? I'll set up here. Oh my god. Died. I have no health. I have to fall back. Because I'm going to do... I'm going to be no help to anybody if I'm dead. Okay, if we can do that. We can, we can say, this could maybe be a, a meme, this may be a thing. Ah, gas passer! Friendly gas passer, or?
This could be a thing. We have a chance here. Nope, nope. Wow, seriously, ready? Three pyros on the fucking one. It's a meme. This could become a meme. Let's play for good at it. Beep boop is, uh, is cleaning my clock though. There of uh And the Uber takes it, I think. Never need four of any class, guys. I'll go something else. Hello there. You guys are gonna be bitter. But what do I go? What is what do the must my team need now? Probably soldier. Let's go soldier. We have no soldiers. Let's do some soldier suppression action here. He's backing up. Okay, there's a good, there's a, there's a thing. Let's serve that puppy. Get some health back. Okay. Medic. Can we get beat to it? Yay! Beat boop! Crit rocket! Oh, who got me? See, I stopped being pyro! Stabbed in the back. I feel like we need four more pyros. I just got stabbed in the back! Doing suppressive fire. Doing the soldier thing. How was that? Killed by the late unbeautifully. All right, we got an Uber on the pipe, though, so that helps. And that gun is up. Let's hear it for the four pyro strat. What's happening? Da, 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 da. I got a massive lag glitch here. I'm having some issues. I gotta take off. Well, that went utterly laggy and completely messed up. And wow, I don't even get frame rate staring at this picture. It's a 17. I think my computer is tired. Tired for today. Yes, my computer is definitely acting a bit twitchy. But just remember, on this note, Jesus is not the boogeyman. Jesus loves you. And he's not there just for when you're dead. He's there to, to give you a full and wonderful life. And that's why you should you know, invest in that relationship. If you invest in that relationship for this life, then 
the next life will take care of itself. That's the message that we have to get across. The images of burning nightclubs, I don't, I don't think it's compelling. I just don't. I don't think scaring people is the way to do it. Hey, if it, hey listen, maybe there's somebody there who needed to hear that message. And God bless the person who's trying to, to pass it on. But still, on that note, this is your Black. Have a great night.